Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I want to say I know how it feels to have to get up here. And when I was your age, there was no way you would have gotten to do it. No way. I was the shyest guy in the crowd. You know, they don't believe it. Shy. I don't talk a whole lot. Trust me. But I thank God. I thank God because without God in my life, if I had to deal with what you guys have to deal with, I don't think I would have made it. If I would have had Facebook and Twitter when I was growing up, I would have made it. There's so much stuff going on. There's so much stuff out there. What you have to deal with is on a level that I did not see. And I thought I was having a hard time when I was growing up. I thought I was dealing with a lot of stuff. And I was. But because you are young people right now who are trying to serve God, the devil has ended up. The devil has raised the stakes. The devil is out to steal your soul. The devil is out to kill you, whether you know it or not. And anytime he has the opportunity, he's going to seize on that opportunity, and he's going to try to take you out. That's why you got to keep your eyes open. You gotta stay away from folk that are not about what you're about. I don't care if your best friend, your best girlfriend, your best boyfriend, if they're not about Jesus, let them go. Let them go. If they lead you the wrong way, drop them. You gotta let them go. It doesn't matter if they smile in your face, it doesn't matter if they say, I love you, it doesn't matter. If they're not about Jesus, keep them in the curve.